Assalamu alaikum warahmatullahi wabarakatuh. Welcome to update number 12. It's been about 14 days or so now since we last uh, showed you around and I've had a lot of requests uh, to, to give an update. There's people eagerly watching. Alhamdulillah. It just shows the interest of the project. Um, if you pan around me now, you'll see behind me that the, the, the walls have been plastered and uh, it's actually started, so it's started to really, really take shape. The next thing up here now, we're waiting for the, uh, the, the glass to arrive and fit it into the frames. Um, a lot of the electric wiring has, has happened. Um, the heating is still on, so there's a lot of warmth coming out from the floor. And within about 10 days' time or so, there should be, we should start laying a new floor here. Um, let's, go, let's go upstairs and show you some of the work we've done in the boardroom. Okay, so here we are now up on the mezzanine floor. And if you come up and you actually have a look around, it gives you an idea now. You can pan straight across. We've just started putting in, alhamdulillah, all the double glazed windows. Uh, with the lead work and you can actually see now the patterns taking shape. Uh, the yellow pattern is, is a box section which follows up through each of the windows uh, and at the top we're going to have a pattern. This pattern is exactly as it was a hundred years ago. This has been copied from the photographs, the black and white photographs and really we've used our best abilities to try to work out the colours from what was here before and from other photography and descriptions of the building. Uh, so we're making good progress there. The guys have just finished that today and they'll be back in a few days time to put the others in. If you follow me through here, this space now, alhamdulillah, is naturally full of light. And you can see now, when we were last year, 14 days ago, the guys were actually putting up all these boards. These boards were going up. Now these are special boards that we're using. We're using a sand block board to reduce the level of sand transfer between the rooms. Um, and again, you can see we have started putting up the glass on the other side. In fact, the window guys told me they've put more up. No. So yeah, we're still waiting for some more glass to go up. Um, but uh, you know, it's making it's ha it's having a, it's having a difference already. You can really get a feel now of of this space um, coming to life, coming together. If you follow me through now into the boardroom, again we've got more glass over here as well. more glass on the walls and you can actually see the old lead work, what the old lead work was like. Now this was replaced after the World War, so this is not the original, original lead work that was put in back in 1892. Um, the original lead work was coloured, which is like the one that we're putting in now, um, but we are for the, the pattern that was put in in 1953 does remain. Um, so it's taking shape, the double glazed units are in, you know, insulating the building. Um, Again, plaster boardings up, so this, this space is taking shape. We're just really waiting now for wiring uh, to follow through, and then we can plasterboard these areas up. Let's go to phase two now, which is where there's been a lot of, a lot of change. Okay, so, he, so here we are in phase two, and there's been a drastic change in here for the good, alhamdulillah. We have, last time we already showed you this area, we exposed the ceiling. On Monday, inshallah, we're hoping for the steel work to arrive and we'll start building this frame, okay? Putting that to one side, if you focus to the left now, you can't see much, okay? So we've ended up scaffolding over what we've just built, all right? But let's try to go into some of the spaces. If you follow me, underneath the scaffold, you see to the left hand side all the stud work that's gone up. These are all the classrooms, okay? So this is going to be where the staircase would go and here, we have, the guys are busy working away. Asalaamu Alaikum guys. This now is our storage room. We are using this for construction works as our storage room. Because the site is constrained, we're trying to keep everything within. Um, this is the science lab. Uh, we'll have all the, uh, the cutting materials, all the drilling machines here. We'll have workbenches in the middle. And then around the sides, there'll be all the gas taps, the sinks, and all the laboratory tests. Uh, we'll put that around the sides. This space in here, another small at the moment we're storing tiles in here, but this will be the woodwork storage room, an equipment storage room, so we'll have all the timber and materials, so when the children are taught and the curriculum for CDT, craft design technology, all that kind of material will be stored in. You can see all the pipe work that's been going in, all the gas main lines, all the underfloor heating pipe work is all running under here, um, so all that kind of stuff's been going on. This is something interesting, we've just gone and purchased a sandblasting machine. Uh, the cast iron arches, inshallah, over the weekend will be sandblasting to bring them back to the original uh, raw material uh, and then we'll be decorating them. But it was uh, a, a good investment. 
so we can clean a lot of stuff. On the left here is the science lab preparation room, so the science teacher will be able to go in there to prepare all the chemicals for teaching uh, before we go in. Um, but generally, this gives you a good idea of the size of the space. So this is a multi-purpose room, a science lab and a craft design technology room. Right, let's go next door. Okay. okay. I've got, I've got Uncle Siddiq here with me, and they have been following this project since we started. But you know what? We're new to the building. They've been part of this building for a long, long time. And the other day, I asked them, I said, you know, I bet you I've been to more places in this building than you have. And they said, no, I bet you I've been to more places in this building than you have. Is that right? And they said, ਕਿਹੜੀ <laughs> 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 So it's hard as you don't know if you can spray it and get the treatment. I'm going to come for a pacao, you know, on the paper. It's a say, but the south sutra, Mahle or South Ali Grandio, yes, he comes to the commission. Sadiko, she said, 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 she जितना सी समान लाई सकने हैं, कंक्रीट तक जाई सकने हैं, तो चेंज करे सके ये बेहतर है। ना ना उनसे बिल्कुल जरा मैं सारे क्योंकि देखे ना जरा पुराने ऑफिस देखे कि लकड़ी बिल्कुल गली ही सी। जी। वो तो कर मतलब और छह महीने साल ना करने तो टेलना ली सी बिल्कुल। वाकिया। तो तो सी जा चाहिए था कि बिल्कुल सारा this is the first time I saw it. 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 I I it's a general track classroom and VV, but you must stay. The scaffolding is a glass handrail, glass handrail, legacy. safety was the Sara Vijana Sari Kadanu treatment, we are in a long last of a to whisky, is kikida napa. Ali Sara Jerana, Lucky Zada Simon, it's a jerry floor and a lucky city is Mark Kalagia, Ejera Tusikam Jeleta Kitasina, Jere Sari partition when I see classroom on the jerry partition when I see a balcony jerry the Boniki community. Sorry, I see Lucky Jerry no Sikatke, the Rafa use kit, a much the Samana. yeah 
ਗਿਆ ਤਾਂ ਉਹਦਾ ਮੁਸ਼ਕਲ ਸੀ ਮੁਸ਼ਕਲ ਸੀ ਲੱਕੜ ਤੇ ਨਹੀਂ ਮਜ਼ਬੂਤ ਨਹੀਂ ਸੀ ਯਾ ਯਾ ਜੀ ਚਲੋ ਆਪਰ ਮੈਂ ਸੀ ਦੱਸਣੇ ਆ ਤੁਸੀਂ ਨੇ ਕਰਦੋ ਅਸੀਂ ਸੀ ਪਾਇਆ ਸੀ ਤਾਂ ਉਹ ਲੋ ਅਸੀਂ ਜਿਹੜਾ ਪਾਇਆ ਓਕੇ ਸੋ ਵੇਰ ਅਪਸਟੇਜ਼ ਨਾਉ ਔਨ ਦ ਟੌਪ ਫਲੋ ਐਂਡ ਇਫ ਯੂ ਪਨ ਅਰਾਉਂਡ ਯੂ ਵਿਲ ਬੀ ਅਬਲ ਟੂ ਸੀ ਦਿਸ ਟੌਪ ਫਲੋ ਵੇ ਬੇਸਿਕਲੀ ਵੇ ਲੁਕਿੰਗ ਟੂ ਗੈਟ 165 ਪੀਪਲ ਅਪ ਹੀਅਰ ਟੂ ਬੀ ਅਬਲ ਟੂ ਪ੍ਰੇ ਐਂਡ ਇਟ ਬੀ ਐਨ ਓਪਨ ਸਪੇਸ ਫੋਰ ਯੂਜ਼ ਬਾਈ ਦ ਕਮਿਊਨਿਟੀ ਐਂਡ ਬਾਈ ਦ ਸਕੂਲ ਐਂਡ ਵਨ ਆਫ ਦ ਮੇਜਰ ਕੰਸਰਨਸ ਵਾਸ ਦ ਦ ਦ ਰੋਟ ਔਨ ਦ ਟਿੰਬਰ ਐਂਡ ਨਾਉ ਦੈਟ ਵੀ ਕਮ ਅਪ ਹੀਅਰ ਐਂਡ ਵੀ ਗੋਟ ਦਿਸ ਸਕੈਫੋਲਡਿੰਗ ਅਪ ਵੀ ਬੀ ਅਬਲ ਟੂ ਸੀ ਪਾਈਸੀ ਦੀ ਕਿ ਤੁਸੀਂ ਇਹ ਫਿਰ ਸਾਰੇ ਐ ਜਿਹੜਾ ਲੋ ਹੈ ਇਹ ਉਸ ਲਈ ਸੀ ਨਵਾਂ ਪਾਇਆ ਹਾਂ ਠੀਕ ਠੀਕ ਇਹ ਐ ਜਿਹੜਾ ਲੋ ਹੈ ਨਾ ਇਹ ਪੈ ਗਿਆ ਸੀ ਇਸ ਕੀ ਇਹ ਸਾਰੇ ਲੱਕੜ ਦੀ ਲੱਕੜ ਦੀ ਲਪਣੇ ਵਾਸਤੇ ਸਹੀ ਕੀਤਾ ਤੁਸੀਂ ਬਿਕਾਜ਼ ਲੱਕੜ ਜਿਹੜੀ ਨਾ ਸਾਰੀ ਗਲੀ ਸੀ ਅੰਦਰ ਜਿਹੜਾ ਨੇ ਸਾਰੀ ਲੱਕੜ ਦੀ ਅੰਦਰ ਖਤਮ ਹੋਈ ਹੈ ਇਨ ਫੈਕਟ ਇਹ ਸਾਰੀ ਜਿਹੜੀ ਨਾ ਸਟਰਕਚਰਲ ਸਟਰਕਚਰਲ ਲੱਕੜੀ ਸੀ ਸਪੋਰਟ ਵਾਸਤੇ ਤਾਂ ਵਾਕਈ ਇਹ ਲੱਕੜੀ ਅਸਾਂ ਦੇ ਹੱਥਾਂ ਵਿੱਚ ਅਸਾਂ ਦੇ ਹੱਥਾਂ ਵਿੱਚ ਨਹੀਂ ਲੈਂਦੀ ਹੈ ਭਈ ਐਂਡ ਵਾਟ ਵੀਰ ਐਕਚੁਅਲੀ ਡੂਇੰਗ ਹੀਅਰ ਥਿਸ ਇਜ਼ ਆਲ ਡਿਕੇਡ ਟਿੰਬਰ ਵੀ ਆਰ ਲੁਕਿੰਗ ਟੂ ਅਪਾਇੰਟ ਅ ਟਿੰਬਰ ਰੈਸਟੋਰੇਸ਼ਨ ਕੰਪਨੀ ਟੂ ਕਮ ਇਨ ਐਂਡ ਟੂ ਸਪਲਾਈਸ ਆਊਟ ਦ ਟਿੰਬਰਸ ਵੇਅਰ ਅਪਰੋਪਰੀਟ ਇਟਸ ਨਾਟ ਆਲ ਦ ਰਾਫਟਰਸ ਇਟਸ ਵੇਅਰ ਮੇਨਲੀ ਦੇਅਰ ਵਾਸ ਗਟਰਸ ਐਂਡ ਵੇਅਰ ਦ ਵਾਟਰ ਵਾਸ ਲੀਕਿੰਗ ਇਨ they're going to come in they're going to take out the rotten timbers splice them out put new timbers in and then we've got a, a timber preservation company a local company uh, a brother who uh, uh, is supporting the project and they will then spray all the rafters and all the beams and before they spray the beams we're going to sand all these down so we come back to the bare wood okay. and then the chemical will be absorbed into the timber um if you come here you will see this this is the old this is the old metal that was put in to support the structure um and this is the new metal that we are adding around around these beams to give the additional support although this frame is actually independent of the uh, of these trusses um this this metal work is to actually support the mezzanine floor that we are creating so alhamdulillah there's been a lot of progress up here we're waiting now for the staircase company to come in and start uh, welding and bolting all the glass balustrading and to the left here you'll see there's a big hole in the floor this is where the staircase inshallah will go oh there could be staircase yeah this is the staircase um and there's another one on the other side so when we both finish side. using the space people can go to both sides and step down so alhamdulillah there's uh, been a lot of progress up here now um it's been covered in the past two days by the scaffolding but it really does uh, show that uh, the space is taking shape okay so here we are in the middle classroom on the first floor and if you pan around you can just see how big these classrooms are now at the moment we're using it as a, as like a tea room and a meeting room space uh, but you can see just really how big these classrooms are we're going to have projectors from the ceiling we're going to have projector screens so the teachers will have uh the ability to teach using IT technology there's these rooms will have wifi in them um adequate power and you know enough natural light coming in too and also there'll be a lot of natural ventilation through the sorry not natural ventilation but a heat recovery system going in which will allow ventilation of air fresh air to come into these rooms so that the students don't get tired by the end of the day um and the head height's great as well alhamdulillah making good progress with the grace of allah we are moving forward as much as we can just before i leave you uh this is actually the back end of the site as we refer it to it's the back end of phase 2 it's where the clock tower is the clock tower is behind me and above this really is one of the areas where we haven't progressed so much because we're focusing on the front side of it but uh two days ago we screened this area and we've been using it for storage here we'll actually have a staircase this will be another staircase that will wind its way up to the upper floor and it will, you will be able to access the other classrooms Uh, and you can see that uh, there still is a lot of work that needs to be done here um but we're progressively moving through the building and um, all these windows that you see as well all these windows will be replaced i guess these were put up as uh, security windows right some graffiti here but all these windows will be replacing so there'll be a much lot of natural light coming in alhamdulillah we thank allah uh, for giving us this opportunity to be able to do this uh, work uh in his house inshallah and all we ask you for is your continuous support for you to continue watching these updates and your dua may allah subhanahu wa ta'ala grant us ease in doing this project and bless us with akh- the with jannah and uh, if you have any questions then drop us a line by email on our website speak to you in the next update jazakallah assalamu alaikum wa rahmatullahi wa barakatuh